Hi everyone, today we're going to look at creating factor trees. So if we take a number, say the number 30, I just have to think of what numbers multiply together to give me the number 30. Now, when we do factor trees, we don't include the number one, okay, because that's a bit pointless. If I was to go one times 30, I'm still stuck with the number 30. Okay, so when I'm creating my factor tree, I'm not including one times that particular number. Okay, so just keep that in mind. So I want to try and find what two numbers multiply together to give me 30. So I could go 1 and 30, but I don't want to include 1. Or I could go 2 and 15. Okay, so I've got 2 and 15. So 2 times 15 equals 30. Now, as soon as I hit a prime number, I need to stop. So is 2 prime? Yes, it is. So I'm just going to put a circle around it. I can't go any further. I can't break 2 down into any other numbers. Whereas 15 I can. 15 is a composite number, so I can break 15 into 3 and 5. 3 times 5 equals 15. And there we go. I have hit prime numbers now. I can't break those numbers down any further. So the number 30 could be written as 2 times 3 times 5. Because 2 3s are 6, and 6 5s are 30. So I've broken my 30 down into its prime um, factors. Awesome, let's have a go at the number 24. So again, I'm going to choose two numbers that multiply together to give me 24. Let's go 2 and 12. Okay, so the number 2 and the number 12. So 2 is prime, so I can't go any further, whereas 12 isn't prime. 12 is composite, so I'm going to split that into 2 other numbers that multiply together to give me 12. So I might go 3 and 4. So 3 times 4. Awesome. One of these numbers is prime. The other is composite. So I can break 4 up into 2 and 2. They're both prime, so I have to stop there. So the number 24 could be written as 24 is equal to 2 times 3 times 2 times 2. Alright, let's have a go with the number 80. So, when in doubt, just divide by 2 if your number's even. So let's go 2 and 40. Okay, 2 is prime, can't go any further there. What about 40? I could go 2 and 20. 2 is prime again, 20 is not, 20 is composite. So I might go 2 and 10. Awesome. 2 is prime, 10 is not, so let's split that into 2 and 5. 2 is prime, 5 is also prime. There we go. We have finished breaking down the number 80 into its prime factors. So the number 80 could be written as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 5. Awesome. And there we go, we have just created factor trees for three different composite numbers. Awesome, thanks for watching.